February 29th. Yeah, I got the date right this time. Anyway, it's February 29th. We're back up here shed hunting again. I figured I'd do a little bit of a opener and see what we could find. Um, sorry, I'm tired. It's a little early. But anyway, we're going back up into that area where I picked up that fresh set and that big, big single to see if we can't match up that single. That's honestly what I'm looking for the most. But I'm cool with anything, so I guess we'll see what I find. See you soon. All right, guys. Well, we're up here hiking away. I got the first one of the day. You can see here there's a bed right here. And then right there, what do we got? I don't think I'm going to do. Ooh, that's, that's a pretty nice looking horn. Looks like last year's. Set up the camera real quick. Okay. Back, guys. Uh, is there another one? Nope. Ooh. Solid three. Good buck there. Well, you know what? That might honestly be fresh. Looks like an early dropper to me. Which is sick. That means that's our third brown already. Which usually for deer sheds, excuse me, me, turn the camera. Usually for deer sheds, I get my butt kicked with browns, so I don't know, hard to say. He's got some weird stuff going on down here. Kind of cool. But uh, I'm gonna do a couple little circles right here and see if he dropped the other side right here. But that's awesome. Got another good little shed. Not a giant by any means, but a real solid three. Brown, at least in color. I can't tell if that, I don't think it's fresh. Looks like a year old, but anyway, doesn't really matter. Great looking shed, still in great condition. So we'll get back to you hopefully here soon with maybe the match. All right guys, I'm gonna do nothing fancy for this one because it's just a little old guy that is chewed all to hell. <laughs> but we got another one. So, that's cool. Right on this little motorcycle trail, too. <laughs> I don't know how many times that's been road past, but we're going to keep on going and see what else we can find. Hopefully, we'll be back to you soon. All right, guys. Hiking out. Um, didn't end up finding anything else up there other than that you know, old chewed up little fork and horn. And then I got this one, pretty good shed. But anyway, didn't find anything else. Started pouring and then stopped and then started and then stopped and then started and blah, blah, blah. But so we're all wet. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here, go home. Might try to put a hike together tomorrow, but I don't know for sure. I guess we'll see. But if not, we will be back to you next weekend to pick up some more or, yeah, whenever we see you. See you soon. All right, guys. We're out here on another hike today. It's March uh, 8th, I think. Yeah, 8th. Uh, we're in an area where I picked up that great big uh, brown fork and horn last year, if you guys remember that. But we're going to get up in here. I'm at a creek crossing right now. You can see kind of why I stopped to take a video. Looks pretty good for some elk. There's tons of sign around, so we're gonna get going and see what we can find. See you soon. All right, guys, I no sooner shut off the camera. I made it maybe, <laughs> I was standing like right there when I took that video. Took like three, four steps this way. Can't really see it, but right there, 
there's I think it's right there there's a deadhead a buck so let's see what we got real quick here all I saw was that little bit of white right there you could tell it was a bone and then I came over here I'm like oh hi <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead get the camera turned around do a pickup real quick all right guys camera work ain't the best for this one but Wide, not very big though. Cool, kinda, gotta leave him here, but found something anyway. Looks like at one point he was probably washed down this creek. I can tell it floods a little bit, but not bad. First find in the morning, so we're gonna keep going and see what else we can find. But. Okay guys, been hiking for a long time. I think we're like uh, six miles in or something. I'm sorry, I can't contain it. There's a there's a fresh side-by-side -side set. They're touching and it's big. I can just see the bases sticking up. Let's see if you can see it from this angle. See the two white things right there? All right, we'll turn the camera around and get a walk up on it, but Freak yeah, guys. I almost just cussed, but I didn't. All right, let's go look at them. Could not believe it when I looked up and saw those things sticking up. He looks thick. It might even be that fork and horn. I think it is, honestly. But look at these freaking things, guys. Don't got to worry about looking for the other side now. Boom. Uh... I don't know if that's a fork. He's got the same shape and he's barely a three and he's got the eye guard. I think it is, but I guess we'll have to see. But boom, look at that. I never find this many freaking fresh sets. And this year I'm already at two. That makes four fresh sheds for the year. Killing it on the freshies. All right, I'm gonna get some pictures real quick and then we'll get them picked up. All right, guys, here we go. Big boy. Oh my gosh, those things are heavy. Big toad of a three point. Heck yes. I think that is that same buck. The buck I came in here to find. I found his other side, or that one single right up here just right up above me same thing in the road and it's just barely off the road this time but he is thick i mean i can't even get my fingers around the bases i mean just a big old thick gnarly thing here let's take and lay them out real quick there they are guys just a gorgeous, gorgeous set. Probably one of my favorite sets I've picked up. I got two years off this buck now. I'm gonna go up and try to find the other side of him. I've gone through so much just amazing looking stuff today. I haven't been able to find anything other than that dead head earlier, but it's just, it's been a grind. And then, <laughs> I was stopped right there where all those pink ribbons are, glassing down into that bottom. And I just turned around and went to walk up the road before I jumped back up into the timber and boom, two freaking studs, st that, excuse me, stud sheds laying side by side, just right off the road. So, all right, we're gonna get back to it and see if we can't find something else because I know there's got to be other sheds in here But either way got the buck we came after <laughs> 